Hey everyone, welcome back to 3D Respawn's Daily Bibleverse. Today's going to be kind of a little uh, lesson that I've learned from a really, really good friend of mine, Jay Mitlow. Um, he teaches Wednesday nights, and it's called Lunchtime in Rome, and it pretty much, we get together uh, like it's a lunchtime in the city of Rome. People get together and just talk about emotions and their hurts and hang-ups, um, but he calls it Lunchtime in Rome because Romans 12, 15 says, uh, Rejoice with those who rejoice and mourn with those who mourn. And that's the verse today. Rejoice with those who re uh, rejoice and mourn with those who mourn. Because a lot of Christians and your friends in the world get it wrong when you're hurting, when you have a hurt and you say, man, I had such a bad day and my boss did this and my friends did that. And their immediate reaction is, oh, I know how you feel. Oh, I did this and I did that. And that immediately takes away from your hurt. And um, it's as easy as just saying after somebody does their says they're hurt about their boss being mean to them just say man I'm so sorry I uh, don't know how you feel but I feel just anger for you and just being able to explain emotion instead of taking away their pain that they're trying to you know let go and even in the fact when they're rejoicing when somebody's like hey I just bought a new car it's fantastic don't be like oh he bought another car oh, man he's got all this money in be happy for the person say man that's awesome that you were able to have another car or you know whatever it's rejoice with those who rejoice and mourn with those who mourn and there's not a better way to explain it than when uh, Mary and uh, Martha were talking to Jesus about Lazarus dying. And it says in the Bible, Jesus wept. And he wasn't weeping because, like, he, he knew Lazarus was dead. Uh, he was weeping because he joined Mary and Martha in their pain. They were crying and they were saying, you know, save him. And he wept with them to share in their pain. And uh, after that, he rose him from the dead. <laughs> but... Um, that's just an example in the Bible how you can mourn with those who mourn. So I hope this helps you out today. Uh, it's just a little piece of what I've learned, and there's a lot more that I'm still learning. Um, but I hope it helps you out. Thanks for checking out 3D Respawn's Daily Bible Verse. Uh, check us out at 3DRespawn.com. Follow us on Twitter and subscribe to us at YouTube. God bless.